All right, here I am in a Google document, and here's the theme I've chosen. When I look at layout, um, I have very limited options, okay? This is it, okay? And uh, when you look at the theme options uh, available to you in Google Slides, uh, the list is not that long, and they're not that exciting. One site I particularly like is slidesgo.com, okay? When you go here, you can search by categories. I like to look in the education section because, well, I'm a teacher, okay? And let's look at one that um, looks interesting to me, okay? So I've used that chalkboard one before, which I really like. But let's look at, oh, I like the colors of this one. Um, let's go, though, to a distance learning. Maybe this makes sense for me. I'm going to click on it. When I do, I just want the Google Slide template because I'm going to pull it straight into Google Slides. It says, would you like to make a copy of it? Yes, please. I want to make a copy of Distance Learning. Okay, I'm going to give that a minute to make a copy. There we go. All right, now I'm going to go back to this presentation. And remember, I was not impressed with the themes here. So I'm going to click Import Theme. And uh, I am going to look, oh, here it is, copy of distance learning. This one uploaded. See here, the other ones I've already done. I want to select distance learning. I want to select distance learning by slides go, and I want to import the theme. Okay, as soon as I do that, now I have this. And when you look at layout, Look at all the options you have, which are not even choices in a regular Google Slides presentation. Okay, lots of options. If I show you one more example, I pulled this one also from Slides Go, this Galaxy one. Okay, when I pull up this theme, import it. When you look at the layout options, again, more than what you have in a normal Google Slides option, and the variation is greater. So importing a theme is a great option if you want to add some originality to your project.